I don't think there's a kid who grew up in this neighborhood who will ever, ever forget. Lights dancing, delicious food. There was music in the streets. How many times did I walk up this street here and they go, Vinci, you want something to eat? Huh? <laughs> that was a family, we were all family. The values that the immigrants brought to this enclave in the south end of Albany were for the most part sustaining values. And my dad was a charmer, he'd be singing and he, before long he had enough money saved that he opened up a store. They knew how to start a business and be independent. You trusted these people who ran these little mom and pop stores. Every member of the family had to work and we all donated our money back to the family. Tough is when you gotta get up every morning and make a living for your yeah. family. That's a tough guy. Always do more than you have to do. Give more, not less. That was the Italian way. We're more than just pizza and meatballs. <laughs> we really felt insulated from evil. But it was the sense of community that was really destroyed, the interdependence, the social structure, the network, the support systems that everyone uh, had built and depended on each other to, to provide. It was gone. They hurt a lot of people. They would condemn her home if she didn't accept their offer. What it did was it gutted that neighborhood and chased a lot of Italian people away. The collateral damage was extraordinary. You've lost something. It could never come back the way it was once the heart had been ripped out of it. I know their spirit is still here.